thinning of hair. Basically, you notice that your ponytail isn't as big as it used to be before. Or, you know, your part is a little bigger than usual. Usually, a lot of people notice this when someone tells them that you can see a little bit of a scalp. Are you losing hair? And that's when you notice, oh, maybe I have been losing hair, you know? That this type of hair loss is seen in women with, between the ages 20 and 30. So it does come earlier in each generation. So every generation, hair fall uh, looks, uh, comes earlier and earlier, which is very unfortunate. Uh, so this is sort of what it looks like. The first one is the typical and generally healthy, normal hair. The second is when you start noticing that you, some people don't even notice at this point, but you start seeing that your part is a lot wider than before. Um, your hair is a little, lot thinner on your head. It's always good to treat it as early as hair fall. It's not like a sudden extra hair fall. It's a gradual loss of hair. It's also called androgenetic alopecia or the other name for it is female pattern hair loss. One of the biggest reasons for this is um, hormonal issues and also genetics. So most people, if there's someone in your family who has you know, who has this type of hair fall where you lose hair on the scalp, then it's possible that you will have it too. It is multi-genetic, so there's many different genes that contributing, it's not just a single gene. So you could be inheriting this from, from you know, your relatives. So if you say, see your mother or your sister and they don't have any hair fall and maybe your grandmother doesn't have that type of hair fall, if your aunt, like your pupu or your khala or somebody has it, it's probably going to come to you. So it doesn't have to be an immediate relative, even a distant relative, if they have that, you might have it. And the unfortunate thing is that it's happening more earlier in the next generation. So let's say if your nani and daddy or pupu, you know, they've had their, they start losing or having that uh, bald spot or that uh, hair loss, you know, in the age of 40 or 50, you might see it earlier in 30s and 20s.